Hi there. Today I'm going to give you a presentation on penny polishing. Penny polishing is a work that we've had on our shelf for quite a long time at St. Edward's and most of you I think have had a presentation on it and it's something that you could do really easily at home because I think that you will have everything you need to polish pennies at home. Let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I have in my penny polishing box. I have vinegar. I have salt. I have a piece of paper towel. I have a Q-tip. And I have some pennies. And then I also have my bag of supplies. So in here, I have got extra Q-tips and extra paper towels because I might need them as I work. Depends how many pennies I'm gonna to polish today. Okay, I also have a plate. This is gonna be kind of like my mat. You know, at school we unroll the mat and then at the end we clean the mat up. Well, I don't have any mats at home and you might have a mat like that at home so you could use it, but I don't, so I'm using a plate. And maybe you could use a plate too. I'm going to unload my box, just like we do at school. My vinegar. My salt. My paper towel for buffing. My pennies. And my Q-tip. Okay. The first thing I need is my penny. Now I need just a tiny bit of salt. I need to unscrew my lid. I'm just gonna take a teeny pinch. I've not too much in my fingers right there. It's just a pinch. Five drops. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe one more. Six, seven. Okay, now we have to count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now I have to buff. So get your paper towel and you're gonna buff your penny. That means rub it hard. Oh, it's so shiny.
Now, I could do more pennies if I wanted to, but for now, I'm going to clean up. So, garbage, garbage, unless you have compost that you can put these in, but I think probably these are gonna go in your garbage. And I'm going to get the work ready for the next time, just like we do at school. I'm going to put a piece of paper towel in here. And now I just need to go and wash my plate. And then I will put everything back on my shelf. See you soon, I hope.